Okay, so uh, is this the way to the bird? Yes, it is. Uh -huh. yep. Now through the winding path. Okay. Now, last time I played, I... No, sorry. Mm -hmm. Just my paranoia speaking. <laughs> oh, you were checking for Flowey, weren't you? Yes, I was! I saw him a couple of times when I first played this game. But he hasn't, he hasn't really? come back since. Shocking. I never saw him once. <laughs> oh, that, that was easy. You hear a passing conversation. So, don't you have any wishes to make? Mm, just one, but... It's kind of stupid. Oh, this is something else I always miss. Um, no, check inside. Yeah, there we go. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? Yes. Let's take a look at those. These used shoes make you feel incredibly dangerous. Which is the opposite of ballet shoes, mostly, but we might as well use them. Yeah, it, it surprised me so much that uh, all the weapons are, are so... Uh, you know, that they have different effects uh, when you actually fight things when I went back. Oh, ring ring. Oh, oh this is the pirate! Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, I was afraid you wanted to know. Uh, her opinion of you is very... murdery. <laughs> so, uh, worry not, dear human. The pirates would never betray you. I am not a cruel person. No, you're too precious. I strive to be comforting and pleasant. The pirate, he smells like the moon. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> Would you like some old spice? <laughs> so because of the in inherent goodness, I told her you were not wearing a nasty tutu. Even though you told me you were! Instead, I made something up! I told... I told her you were wearing... a bandana! <laughs> <laughs> it pained me to tell such a bold-faced lie! <laughs> I know you would never, ever wear a bandana! But your safety is more important than fashion! Then, I just want to be friends with everyone! Oh, we love you, Papyrus, and what am I wearing? Uh, <laughs> so, I've got the punch, the ice cream, the band, the quiche, the band. Okay, so yeah, I'm still wearing the uh, tutu. Yes, you are. Alright. Oh, who's come here? Oh, it's Washua again. Hello, Washua. <laughs> clean me! Green means clean! <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell who's doing the bird. <laughs> I think everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Everyone has done the bird at some point. <laughs> everyone except me is the bird, and I'm Washua. That makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> Passing conversation. Don't say that. Come on, I promise I won't laugh. Hmm. The power to take their souls. This is the power that the humans feared. Oh god. Oh boy. <laughs> Hello. Uh, you're the crap out of me. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> oh. Uh, who has this one? I totally can't I do. Oh, oh great. Boy. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Howdy ho. <laughs> Notice you were here. I'm Onion Zan! Onion Zan, you hear? Go away, Onion Zan! <laughs> You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it! <laughs> yeah, me too! It's my big favorite! <laughs> Just keep on walking. Even though the water's getting so shallow here, 
I have to sit down all the time, but... Hey, that's okay! It beats moving to the city! <laughs> and living in a crowded aquarium! Like all my friends did! I think they're oh on the God, menu at the hotel! the most heartbreaking thing! <laughs> <laughs> and the aquarium's full anyway, so... Even if I wanted to... That's okay though, you hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? Uh-huh. Okay. Hey there, that's the end of this room. See you around, have a good time. In Waterfall. Bloop, 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 bloop. <laughs> Onion Sin, like, scared me and then just completely broke my heart. Uh -huh. Oh my god. <laughs> Shiren hides in the corner, but somehow encounters you anyway. And you just have to keep mashing the uh, hum option. Okay. And be ready to dodge. Tone deaf, she's too ashamed to sing her deadly song. Oh, hello. Wow, steady. Just remember, she plays music, so even though we can't hear it currently, she's gonna be uh, singing. Oh, Jesus! Uh, sorry. <laughs> yeah, I, d I thought I'd never seen this enemy <laughs> before, or I forgot about it. Uh, you hum a sad song. Shiren follows your melody. Wum 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 wum. Shiren seems much more comfortable singing along. You hum some more. Monsters are drawn to the music. Suddenly, it's a concert. Sounds like uh, Sans is selling tickets made of toilet paper. Fun fact in the genocide route, you get a different message for that. <laughs> yeah, you do. You hum some more. The seats are sold out. You feel like a rock star. First concert using uh, Mario Paint. Uh, the crowd tosses clothing. It's a storm of socks. Scandalous. <laughs> you have some more, but the constant attention, the tours, the groupies, it's all aggressive tooting. <laughs> <laughs> well, that escalated quickly. Shiren thinks about her future. You and Shiren have come so far, but it's time. You both have your own journeys to embark on. You hum a farewell song. Final toot. End! Wow. <laughs> Encore! Bravissimo! Now, this gives us a bonus uh, later on in the game oh, it against does? a certain enemy. Okay. The Northern Room hides a great treasure. Okay, so I remember how to get that, but I don't remember the solution, so, uh... This power has I no can. counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. And an incredible power would be needed to take the soul of a living monster. There is only one exception. The soul of a special species of monster called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death if only for a few moments. A human could absorb this soul, but this has never happened. And now, it never will. Dun dun dun! Oh. Hello, statue. It's a statue. The structures at its feet seem dry. What a sad statue. Please take one. I want to know the story behind that yeah. statue. You took an umbrella. What were you saying about the melody? I said it's about to get a lot sadder once you hear that melody and you remember, you know, whose theme that is and everything. Oh, yeah? Put the umbrella on the statue? Yes. Dun 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 <laughs> Yeah. You place the umbrella atop the statue. And now you can go back to the, uh, piano room that we skipped. Inside the statue, a music oh, yeah. box begins to play. 
Do you have space in your inventory, by the way? Um, no, he doesn't. Uh, let's just use okay. a uniscal. Well, I think there's a box up there anyway. Oh, no, there's not. Okay. <laughs> there's a piano here. Play it. Okay. Oh. Well, that was quick. <laughs> Leave it to a musician to be really good at that. Absolutely. <laughs> a haunting song echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Papyrus. Papyrus. Ah, uh, that's not an item. Sell Papyrus. Huh? Are you serenading me? <laughs> oh no! Blush. You're eating all my standards! <laughs> <laughs> Let's write a musical about our adventure! We okay. can call it Undertale the Musical. Really that. <laughs> it's the magic artifact. Did I check the sign before? No, it doesn't say anything. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Yes! Why not? <laughs> You're carrying too many dogs. What? So look here, what? inventory. What? Annoying what? dog. What? <laughs> I think you used the annoying dog. Annoying oh, dog. But first, there's something you need to do before you do that. Okay. It's a little white dog and it's fast asleep. What do we what do we need to do before that? Okay, so this goes back to when we were still in the ruins and Toriel told you to wait in that one room and of course we didn't. Oh, God. If, you actually, if you actually did, like she'll call you back around every five minutes or so. It takes about 45 minutes to see this whole exchange, but... Mm -hmm. Um, eventually she gets her phone stolen by an annoying dog. <laughs> so call Toriel in this room. What? It worked? What? The ringing is coming from inside your inventory. Oh my oh, god, I thought she just hated us. That's oh. why she doesn't answer. Yep. Oh, oh my god. That is astonishing. Mystery <laughs> solved. <laughs> There is so much in this game! Uh, let's try to use this annoying dog. You deployed the dog! Oh! Hello. Woof, 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 woof. Uh, the dog absorbs the artifact. I don't know if dogs were meant to be that. Bye! <laughs> Bye! Now, take Bye, Colin Toriel again. <laughs> oh, calling Toriel again? That's not, well, why not? Nobody picked up. Yeah, because the dog has the phone now. <laughs> and, that's, and that's why she didn't answer you this whole time. Oh. Dog residue. Dirty dishes left unwashed by a dog. Oh gosh, if you like fill your inventory with those things, uh -huh. the descriptions. There's like six different descriptions for them, and they're all amazing. All right. And they all do different things. <laughs> all right, well, uh, we'll... We'll pack that in the box. Well, I can't pack that in the box because uh, we're full, but uh, at some point we'll get to sell these items and. Uh... You can clear up some space in Temi Village. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yep. The music continues and doesn't stop. That would be what continuing is, yes. <laughs> Let's take another umbrella. You took an umbrella. I want the green one. <laughs> I, th this one <laughs> might be green. What color is this one? That one's red. red. Okay. That's close enough. I think this is my favorite part of the game. Fun well, fact, if you play the genocide, if you have a genocide root paint, you'll get a different reflection there. Mm. <laughs> think happy thoughts. <laughs> Yo, you got an umbrella? Awesome. Let's go. Oh, baby. <laughs> Poor baby has no arms. <laughs> I still stand by my headcanon that he's actually a baby T-Rex and he just has... <laughs> he's a chuck in his shirt! ...stick out of the shirt. Uh -huh. Yes, I agree with that headcanon. Man, I'm dying is so cool! She feeds some bad guys and never loses! She doesn't afraid of anything. <laughs> <laughs> if I was a human, I would wet the bed every night! Knowing she was gonna beat me up. <laughs> <laughs> Walking <Yeah>. faster. <laughs> oh god, I just remembered what uh, um, umbrellas uh, signify in Japanese culture, like uh, two people walking under one. That means they're in love, doesn't it? 
Yeah, you're effectively on a date with Monster Kid right now. <laughs> yeah, except he has yet to actually be oh. under your umbrella. He has some <laughs> and, um... projects where we had to take care of the flower. The king. We have to call him Mr. Dreamer. Volunteer to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to the school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if a guy came to school? <laughs> <laughs> she could be of all the teachers. <laughs> and she so would, too. She would just, like, suplex all of them. Fun yes. fact, that flower is accessible if you cheat, and it does say something. I... What, what does it say? I don't remember, but it says something. <laughs> oh, well, thank you. <laughs> With just, you know, if you're messing around and you get bored in Undertale, then... <laughs> Uh, you get bored in this game. <laughs> um, maybe she wouldn't be up the teachers. Oh no, she totally would. <laughs> She's too cool to ever hurt him as a person. <laughs> I remember once in a, a very boring English lesson, one of my friends said, wouldn't it be great if Lara Croft came in through that window, blew Mr. Thompson's head off and said, I'm the new student. Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> when, I, when, when anyone saw that castle, did, they, did anyone think about Disney World? Or... Yeah. That actually, it, with the the silhouette lighting and everything, that actually does look kind of romantic. Aww. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was I was at Disney World once, but they were doing the fireworks show uh, at the time at the same time as uh, when you wish upon the star. So it was it was so smooth and orchestral. When you wish upon a star, bang! <laughs> <laughs> It's so relaxing. Oh, this poor thing. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yo, you want to see I'm dying, right? <laughs> I'm on my shoulders. Yeah, I want to see her before she sees me. <laughs> oh, poor uh, so, question, Please. Monster Kid, ab about this plan of yours. Uh, shoulders, you say? <laughs> <laughs> perfectly triangle-shaped body. Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way through. Goodbye. What? <laughs> oh, no. oh. The humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. Hmm. The serene sound of a distant music box that fills you with determination. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful and thus monsters too weak. Not a single soul was taken and countless monsters were turned to dust. Uh oh. And we're going to be in a minute. <laughs> well, you know what this lighting means. Uh huh. Oh God. Well, nice knowing you. Alright, change plans. <laughs> Get out. And now you have terrible aim. Run, run, or you'll be well done. <laughs> ah. Okay. Actually, that one wasn't a bad shot. <laughs> uh, yeah, that was pretty good. Oh, my God. Run, 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 coward. Uh. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> uh. I have to say the star set up was my uh, tablet noise, and boy, is it fun when I go to a public place and I hear <laughs> run, run, run! Oh I've had the Metal Gear, you know, the exclamation mark sound for ages, and it, it scares me to death every time, and I keep on meaning to change it. <laughs> I have a story about that, and I'll tell you later. <laughs> Okay, so just uh, weird. This thing's popping up faster and faster. Faster and faster. They are. She actually is getting frustrated. Yeah, she loses uh, her temper if you if you stay on the screen too long without. Uh... Yeah, she's she's not the most even tempered of people. <laughs> not really. Oh. Uh oh. Oh. Oh well. Hello. 
Goodbye. <laughs> uh, oh. Uh, ah! Plop. <laughs> it's like the beginning of Undertale. Hmm. It sounds like it came from over here. Oh, you've you've fallen down, haven't you? Uh, are you okay? Uh, here, get up. Team, huh? That's a nice name. My name is...